Dear viewer, you are watching Diary 13 on holiday. Sweeping countryside, small villages in Suffolk, staying in a posh barn conversion with a unique private restaurant next door. This is a fine holiday, one of the best I've ever had. Exploring the area through deserted roads. No internet, no Nero. Just a feeling of being. Spotting owls at night, swatting flies by day. I've been dreaming as well. Among the darkness, I dreamt that I was now free. I did not have to do anything I didn't want to. Day one. Went out to the seaside. Dunwich. Came home after hunt for food, booze, fags and ATM. Had an incredible evening in the private restaurant next door. Unbelievable in general. Lovely food in a wonderful setting. Funny coffee making afterwards. Day two, went out exploring, ended up in dis, many jokes, tried downloading San Andreas, no success, home and leftovers, chess, etc. Day three, went out to Southwold, nice pier, Fun times, odd amusements. Day four, out to eye, not much there but a smell, another meal in our private restaurant. Day five, stayed in, got San Andreas on my tablet, a lot of fun. Day six, Walderswick. Beach, sand dunes, rivers. Last day today, and one final visit to restaurant. I hear the sounds of conkers falling from the tree. I see the red lights of the TV tower nearby. The clouds are illuminated by the moon. I dreamt that it was the last day of the holiday and I had forgotten large sections of it. I knew that it was because I had not lived through those days yet that I could not remember them. Sitting here now on the last day, I understand now that it was a projection of a deep-seated wish that we did not have such memory, that maybe we could live a life where some mystery remains and it does not seem like a threat. When we look back and re-manifest our pasts, we lose something of the present. 
That said, however, we would not be human without the remembrance of times past. And holidays from time to time remind us of who we are. Much love, Tim.